Hi, Laura Bizwick here again. Yesterday I talked about how we propagate papayas because a lot of people have been asking me about that. And today um, in my hand here is uh, a guava, guava um, tree, guava seedling. And um, we don't grab this one. A lot of people have been asking, how do you hasten the fruiting process of a guava because it takes a bit of time to start uh, fruiting. But there are simple techniques that we use um, in permaculture to hasten the fruiting process. We don't graft this one because it has a thin um, um, cambium, so we, you, you can't, it's very difficult to um, graft this one. But what you do is um, you take a, um, a fruit from um, a tree which is not diseased, a uh, well fruiting tree, and then a ribbon fruit, you take that one, you cut the fruit, and you take the seeds out of the fruit um, and then you put the you soak the seeds in water for 94 hours but every day um, if you soaked the the seeds uh, around nine o'clock or seven o'clock or eight o'clock depending on the time you soak the seeds you make sure that uh, every day same time you change the water so you remove the water and add another water up to 94 hours after 94 hours, um, you take the seeds out of the, the water and then you clean them. You put them on a cross and then you start cleaning. The secret here is that we are taking out the slimy outer coat because that's what makes the guava tree to take more years to start fruiting. So if you just clean the seeds, you clean the seeds and you sow them in the nursery um, and then you take that tree and plant just after one and a half years or two years you start having fruits so that's how we propagate a guava thank you very much thank you